my big giant large corporation is investing in the wealth development of that minority owned business. And that's really critical. If you have a company that decides that not only are they going to build their own wealth, but they're going to help build the wealth of an underrepresented business owner, that's a huge, huge mind shift in my estimation, because that's the place that I think America has been the greatest is helping, you know, businesses and entrepreneurs succeed, you know, to help them win. That's, that's how we've built the country by businesses building, you know, building themselves up and, and, you know, helping employ people and, and, and making things better in communities and neighborhoods and building infrastructure. So, um, you know, I don't know how to get to that place. Yeah, me neither. I was- <laughs> <laughs> We're going to solve poverty with this podcast. I lead with my excellence. On the other end, as a corporate structure, you should lead with wanting to understand more and wanting to diversify more and understanding why that's important. We can't be both sides of the conversation. So we as business owners, we as, you know, underrepresented groups of people who have technical skills or or professional services or build products and things like that. We can't be the ones saying there needs to be more diversity. 